You'll play. It's perfect. Truly carpented. They will cheer and throw up their sweaty nightcaps. Hmm. Only one thing. What's that? Where are you? Where are you in your play, Will? I should be there? Well, just as I am Dr. Faustus, who sold his soul for a moment of idle curiosity. And that whole pile of paper, I know not who you are, what you love. Love? Hate. I love the theatre. Oh, men don't love bare boards and painted faces. Who do you love? Apart from pot women. I have a boy. A rascal son in Stratford. Him I love. Or nothing. Well, then, the worst you can imagine is for a father to kill his son. Well, why not? In civil war, it could happen, such as in these, contention of the roses. It's not to be imagined. Then imagine it. Write me a scene. A soldier kills an unknown adversary. The helmet is off the corpse. Behold, his son. Why do you write it? Think of your rascal. Bring it to me tomorrow, no. There is no play tomorrow. It's the Feast of Ascension. We shall dine. Shall we? In on Deptford Strand, kept by a queen of pot women, Mistress Bull. Wrote my first couplet to her. There I will tell you if you are a playwright or but a jobbing carpenter. I shall not. What? Am I your hairdresser that you command a scene off me like a ounce of civet or a scented handkerchief? Will you strike your bell and I must crow for you, your little rooster? I have writ this great pile of paper alone without your stir. And while you slept or were at your toilet, I have become the maker of three plays historical with one more and a, 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 a comedy promised.